first, she's my darling from Down Under and the sexiest Aussie since Dave Medna. Give it up for Danny Minogue! <laughs> Let's have a drink. <laughs> What's your favourite drink? If I could get you anything right now. Baby Sham? Oh, go on. So, I'm going to ask you about Aussies. Why do they stick an O on the end of everything? It's like, let's go to the bottle O. <laughs> There's a woman with, like, um, a cropped hair and flat shoe. Letho. <laughs> Well, we kind of shorten all the words, don't we? You know, you sunnies do. and... We don't have time to hang around with all of that talking. <laughs> well, cheers, love. Cheers, love. Thanks for cheers. coming on. Mm. Who's looking after your baby, Ethan, tonight? <laughs> um, Ethan's in Australia. Oh, He's in Australia, so just a flying him? visit. Yeah, absolutely. Oh. Yeah, we do little video calls and um, checks out his dummy and blows me a kiss. Oh. Yeah. Cos I was wondering where he was, cos, you know, you get some mums who just leave him in the car outside. <laughs> <laughs> and I thought... Oh. So I, I thought you were going to offer some babysitting services. I should have a crash, shouldn't mm. I? Yeah, why not? Cos we're trying to get Angelina Jolie. You need a big crash. <laughs> yes, and lots of nannies. But how old is he, Ethan, now? He's 15 months and he's just started walking and, yeah, he's just gorgeous. But you come from showbiz royalty. Are you going to be a pushy mum? Are you going to, like, spray tan him and, like, stick him on the stage <laughs> with a tiara? <laughs> When it comes to your place. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie Ellen's here! The queen of the machine. <laughs> his his favourite thing is his ball, and he's always saying ball, ball, and he's going and chasing that. So, yeah, I don't think he's, he's going to be into the stage performing and stuff. No. So, yeah, sports. Well, you have to be worried with Auntie Kylie, don't you? You know what I mean? <laughs> it could turn into a big gayer if you're not careful. <laughs> No, no! I'm not saying that's a bad thing, but, like, no, you know, oh, just try these off pads on. Well, it's always... That's how I started. <laughs> that Kylie show! You know? <laughs> <laughs> what effect has the baby had on your relationship with Chris? Oh, God, it's just... It's absolutely life-changing. Oh, you imagine. have no sleep, for starters. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, it's been an incredible... Incredible time. Is Chris going to make an honest woman of you soon? Do I hear wedding bells? Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's not something... We've talked about it a little bit, but it's not something that is sort of at the forefront of our minds. Why you've, Have you got, like, a flower girl dress to wear? Uh, yeah, what, oh, my, yeah. What are your plans? Well, my dog wants to come down your aisle with, like, a... Um... <laughs> it sounded a bit wrong, but... Um... <laughs> Awkward. Um... <laughs> <laughs> and then what? And then, what happens after no, that? No, with the ring on its head, you know, like on a little cushion. <laughs> oh, you are just filth. <laughs> I've got to ask, is it true? Are you going to do Britain's Got Talent? No plans at the moment for any... Any TV here? No, mm -hmm. just uh, back to Australia and a um, bit of sunshine and Christmas, yeah. Have you been asked to do it? Hmm. I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's nice to be asked, isn't it? There's been a few discussions about, I don't know, opportunities here. <laughs> Awkward! <laughs> <laughs> I've got to ask you about X Factor. Were you pushed or did you jump? <laughs> we want to know. Um, it's kind of a tricky one because by the time um, they came back to me with the dates, OK, here, here are the actual dates because it had changed a few times, um, I'd already locked in Australia's Got Talent and um, it would have meant me flying back and forth from Australia to London weekly to film. Oh, and I don't know if anyone's like. done that flight. Taking everything to it into account and, and being a new mum, there was just no way that it would work for me. But um, 
I'm sure if, if I wanted to get on a plane, they, they would have had me there, but it just, I, no. I couldn't do it. So yeah. it's kind of come into my life and, and gone. It's what's turned you into a style icon. Um, it's, it's, well, that moment when the doors open oh, no. and, uh, and then people used to tell me that they used to pause because mm. I, I didn't, I couldn't work out how everybody could analyse every little bit of what you were wearing, but they said they paused the Sky TV. Plus, yeah. But did you know everyone was going, oh, who's going to win this week, Cheryl and Danny? Was you aware of that, like all this? Oh, <gasps> we knew that was going on mm. and there's, you know, what can you do about it? You just turn up in a frock that you like and yeah. you see what happens. Mm. Um, when you win, you go, yeah. Did you ever see Cheryl turn up and go, saying, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck, Cheryl. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take oh that my as God. a yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> All the time, Ella. You've brought out your own fashion Bible, haven't you? Yeah, it's a bit of a book on all the, the tips and tricks and stuff that I've learnt from people along the way. Oh, I never thought you went like that to me. <laughs> from you. From you. Thank you. And you and you. you, and you. <laughs> Do you know I'm not, don't take this the wrong way, but it's a good toilet read. Is it? No, and I mean, no, that is... And that's a good thing. Honestly, hey. I was sitting there going, I wish I had constipation so I could read a bit more. <laughs> honestly, no, it, I love, honestly, all the tips. Lady Gaga's coming on later. What do you think about her fashion? I want to know how she travels with all of that stuff. I want to yeah. know, because I'm always packing my suitcases and I'm, like, very particular about it, but, like, her headdress is like this and the skirt's like I that. She, does she take just a plane full of stuff? And I, don't, <laughs> I can't work it out. Well, I was reading yours here. This is her, her holiday essentials. Scarf, parasol, flat bag, fan, a hat, sunglasses. I like to take a passport with me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm only off the blackboard. <laughs> oh, Danny, it's been absolutely lovely having you on. Thank you. Thank you for all your handy hints. Honestly, it's really good. If There's you lots want. of tips and stuff in there. No, and, and embarrassing pictures, so... <laughs> yeah, and it's great for if you're on the toilet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Danny Minogue, everyone. <laughs> Peter Kay and Lady Gaga will be here. I'll see you in part two.